I'm in love with all your lights and your colors. I'm in love with all your nights. But you've kept me far away from my focus. And to my heart, I cannot lie. Namaskar. Welcome back to your channel, Simplify Your Space. A very good morning to you all. Today, I shall take you around my morning routine from a rented home. These days, I usually get up around 5.45 a.m., which is about 15 minutes earlier than usual. Mornings in Bangalore can be nippy in monsoons. Surya Devta badlo se luka chipi karte rehte hain. I just love these amazing mornings. And every night when I go to bed, I really look forward to spending this me time the next day. After freshing up, I change to workout clothes and around 6.15 am, I go down for a good 40 minutes walk. Before leaving, I set up one load of laundry so that once I'm back, the clothes are washed. And see, it has started to drizzle. Hope it does not intensify further. Glad it stopped and I could maintain my walking routine. Only a few people are walking at this time. Greenery at my place of stay is so soothing. Landscaping is cost and labor intensive, but undoubtedly it looks so beautiful. I really enjoy my walks and try my best not to skip it even on weekends. I think all this health consciousness comes with time. As we grow old, health becomes the priority. After finishing my walk, I go back and start with Rosemarra Ke Kaam. Although we are living in a rented house for some time, my routine is almost the same as before with a few extra tasks added. It's been almost a month since we moved in here and I have started to miss my home. I hope the renovation and repair work finishes soon and we can return to enjoy upcoming festivals from there. Meanwhile, my husband is also back from work. He had a night shift. As my husband is back, he will be waking up our son while I go back to the kitchen and start preparing his breakfast. These days, he is in love with French toast and wants to have it almost every day for breakfast. It is also very easy to make. My son has grown up and is able to do his morning rituals independently. I hardly help him in anything, except sometimes he wants me to feed him breakfast. Kids grow up so fast. I wish I could still keep him as a little cute baby who always wanted to cuddle around. He still does. Little cuddling and it's time to go to school. He doesn't carry school tiffins as meals are provided by the school. One less work for me. After sending Athar to school, I have come to prepare breakfast for my husband. As he was awake the whole night, he plans to sleep now. In my last three videos, you must have seen my four burners cooktop. It was 10 years old and as it was kept in storage for a long time, it wasn't working well and needed immediate service. Thankfully, I had this Borosil Flare glass top stove, three burner cooktop and this video is made in collaboration with Borosil. It was very easy to install. It comes with rubber anti-skid legs which keeps the cooktop sturdy. This is available with different combinations of burners 2, 3 and 4. The gas chula is made of 6 mm toughened glass that gives it a clean and classic look. The brass burners make cooking fast and fuel efficient. 
Ergonomically designed knobs help to easily adjust flame intensity and the sturdy pan supports ensure that your cookware remains steady throughout the cooking process. The gas stove is very easy to clean and maintain. The gas stoves also come with a cleaning pin that makes it easy to clear clogged burner holes. And the best part is there is a lifetime warranty on the glass. Presently, there is a 50% off on Borosil Flare glass top gas stove, which is a great deal. The purchase link is mentioned in the description box. My husband has gone to sleep and I started with a quick cleaning. Made bed and quickly dust the room. This house is just next to the main road, so every day a lot of dust accumulates. So daily dusting is required, but I finish it quickly as there are very limited items. Now I am going to water the plants. I have brought all my plants here except the big ones. Watching my plants grow and bloom makes me so happy. There was a time when I didn't know anything about growing plants. Time flies. By the time I finish all these chores, my house help comes and take over the rest. Now I will go and take shower. After shower, I offer my prayers to God. As we are living here temporarily, I couldn't make proper temple. So Bhagwan Ji ka arrangement kya small table par hi kar diya. Now I will prepare tea and breakfast for myself. And today I am making a pizza vegetable sandwich with ricotta cheese. I usually have my breakfast on the couch while watching something on the TV. After finishing my breakfast around 9.30, my photographer arrives and he starts his work. I frequently visit my house which is under repair to see the progress of the work. Also if anything is not going as per plan, we need to discuss and replan things. Now I am back. Today I have to finish some self shooting which means I have to get ready and put on some makeup. Usually my makeup is very simple and I'm done in 10 minutes. I'm ready. Now let's finish the shoot. After finishing the shoot, I woke up my husband and we quickly grabbed some fruits. Now we have to go out to select some material for the house. These days we go out frequently to buy stuff for renovation. Just like our home, roads in our area are also under repair and renovation. That means slow moving traffic. We went to the Design Cafe Experience Center to see some stuff. Whenever you are making your home, it is always good if you can spare some time and visit a few good interior experience centers. You can get a lot of good ideas about the material and trends. As specific areas are properly designed, you get better idea how your house will eventually turn out. After finishing our work, we are going for a quick, unhealthy but tasty lunch. We need to rush back quickly before my son comes back from school. And that's all about my busy morning routine these days. 
yes things are different and managing home work and interiors together is a bit challenging but i am enjoying this phase hopefully everything turns out as per plan and we go back to our beautifulness soon thank you all for watching this video see you all next week bye bye